Hey guys, uh, I just got done um, making a portable USB uh, charger um, that could charge cell phones or uh, iPods, anything that runs off of a USB. Uh, I'm just going to go through uh, the steps of what I did to make it. Um, first, I took a 9 volt battery, just a regular Duracell battery. Um, and then I got a, uh, a clip that goes onto the end of it uh, from Radio Shack. Um, it has two two wires coming out, a red and a black, so that's power and ground. Um, what I did was I hooked my power up to a switch. Um, you don't have to hook it up to a switch, but um, that's just what I wanted to do for added functionality, I guess. And um, Anyways, but after uh, I hooked it up to the switch, I uh, ran it through a voltage regulator right here. Um, I also picked that up from Radio Shack. Uh, this is a 5 volt voltage regulator. Um, it drops the voltage down to the 9 volts to 5. Um, just so, because that's what the USB right here, that's what USB, uh, the voltage that uh, USB needs to run. Um, so that's what I did with that. Uh, I also added in an LED to know whenever I, it was turned on, um, just to make sure that, that there was power getting to the uh, voltage regulator here. Um, and uh, to do that, I had to add a um, 150K resistor uh, to drop the voltage down to 2.2, which is what the LED uses, so I wouldn't uh, blow out the LED. Um, yeah, pretty. Uh, the switch here, uh, I want to talk about it. It's got uh, six prongs on it. Let's see if I can get this turned around. It's got six prongs on it. I don't know if you could see that very well. My camera doesn't really focus. Um, it's got six prongs on it, and what I had to do, um, it's a double throw uh, switch, so that means it, it, the middle is off, and left is on, and right is on, but if I only had it connected to the middle one, and like and one of the outer ones, it would only work if I turned it to like, let's say if I had it connected to this one and that one, it would only work if I flipped it to the left. So I bridged those two right there. Um, to make it as one, so if I flip it to the left, it'll turn on. To uh, flip it to the right, it'll still turn on. Um, I have the output of my voltage regulator going into the middle one, um, and my power coming out of the battery going into the uh, the far right one here. Um, and then I just added that bridge right there, so it'll flip on both ways. Um, let's see here. It's getting tangled up. Right here, you can see the voltage regulator. Um, the left side or the far side is uh, is um, your your input. The middle is ground, and the this right here, where my fingers at, is the output, which is where you want to connect your uh, USB uh, power wire to, which is right here, which is the red one. Um, USBs have four wires in them. They have a power, a ground, and two data uh, data cables. Um, you're not going to need the, the green and the white ones, uh, which are the data. Uh, you just need the red and the black one and connect the red one to the output right here and then connect the ground to the middle of the voltage regulator um, just because you need a ground. Um, let's see here. Um, that's pretty much it. You know, you just, um, I'll just show you how it works, I guess. Um, Got my my cell phone plugged in. Let's see here if I can get the whole wire in there. So it's not plugged into anything else. Okay, and I'm gonna flip the switch. I guess I'll show you how it's a double throw. Um, I'll try to flip it towards me. LED comes on. Flip it away from me. LED comes on. Phone is charging. You can tell by the uh, the light right there. I don't know if, you, if any of you have an Android uh, powered phone that the the amber light right there. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Turn it off and the LED still shines for a second because there's still power. Um, but yeah, that's it. I mean, I'll be glad to help out anybody that needs any help, and I'm gonna put a uh, schematic up of what the uh, the wire and diagram and everything is like that. So uh, if you have any questions, just leave a comment.